to everyone continuing on the previous video which was on half header we are going to discuss about the full header the main disadvantage of the half header was that we cannot have a three input combination and we cannot perform addition of the three input for the half header this disadvantage can be solved by using the full header so full header has the three inputs and two outputs you can see that abc are the three input and salmon carry are the two output we will have a total of eight possible input combinations and for which we get the sum and C out, which is the carry. So will we perform a KMAP simplification? By the KMAP simplification, we, uh, we will have a two KMAP as we have a two output sum and carry. So we will uh, get a one expression for sum and carry. By using this expression, we are going to design a circuit. This is a logical circuit for the full adder now what is our task is to verify this full adder logic design using this truth table this is our experiment so here what we are going to require we require three inputs two xor two and gate one or gate and two indicator for sum and carry so now going on to the task so go to place component place the ice uh, we are having the switch to place the switch Flip it horizontally. Make three copies. Copy. Set plus we paste. We have three input. That's why we make three copies. Now place the VDD, VCC, and ground component sources VCC. Place component ground okay connect one terminal to vcc another to ground one terminal to vcc another terminal to ground connect this to ground this also to ground now we are going to have a two xor place component TTL 74 LS 86 place to XOR 1 B2 place to AND gate component 740 LS 08 for ls08 okay place two b now place one or gate component sand for three two one two three two send for ls32 now we require two indicator for some and carry place component indicator probes place to make a copy and now paste it serial plus we paste now look at the logic data and how to connect them so we have to connect two input to one x or b first of all connect a and b give it a name a b and this is our C. Okay. So connect A and B to one XOR. Bring it toward this direction. One A and B to XOR. Now connect A and B to one. A and B to one and get connect A and B to one and get now after that connect output of first XOR to the input of second XOR.
and connect one terminal of data XOR to AND gate. And second terminal from here. Connect the output of two and get to the OR gate. To the OR gate. Now what is remaining? We have to connect C to the here. So connect C here. Now we will get a some here and carry here some and sorry. So now I think the circuit is all completed. Let's see, check it once again. We have one as out to end gate connected to the input. Okay. So now we are going to verify the truth table for the input 0, 0, 0, sum and carry R0. Simulate it. For input 0, 0, you have a sum and carry 0, 0. For 0, 0, 1. You get some one carry zero any C is one. You get some one carry zero, right? Some one carry zero. For B is equal to one again, same in output. B is equal to one. B is equal to one again, some carry zero. Fourth, fourth, B and C are one, carry is one. B and C are one, carry is one, sum is zero. Right now, A is one, B and C are zero. B and C are zero, A is one. You get someone carry zero. Someone carry zero. Now you have one zero one, B is zero. B is zero. C is one. You get carry one, some zero. Carry one, some zero. For one one zero, same. 1 1 0 you get the same carry 1 some 0 and for the last 1 1 1 you get 1 1 you get 1 1 thank you for watching this video